Hi guys, it's Mark. Today I'm at Manchester Primark and I actually want to show you around Primark and see what it's all about, especially for you viewers who have not been to Primark before if you're abroad. We love Primark here in Great Britain and I'm going to be doing a £30 Primark beauty challenge. So I'm going to look around Primark, look at the beauty section. The beauty section in Manchester Primark is really, really good and it's got a lot of products in that way. I really rate Primark beauty and let's see what we can buy for £30. Primark now I don't know what I'm going to be looking for but we're just gonna go through the different aisles and see what we can find. Nails. I love nails. So many. See these? How oh, cute. So I'm not gonna get all the matte ones. Let's get all the matte ones and then just like narrow it down as we get into the bottom. That's not mad. I wish they had more colours with the matte ones. I'm sure they did before. This is literally Kim Kardashian stuff. This is very nice. This looks lovely. These are sick. How much is this? We'll put it in. Primark is literally closing down. I just bought my stuff and I'm gonna go out and show you guys what I got. Okay guys, so Primark has closed down. We were there until closing time. Now I've got my big bag of stuff right here and let's see when I get home what I got and if the challenge was a success. Okay guys, we are now back at my place and I've got my Primark bag here. Now let's see what we got and I'm gonna accumulate everything with a total after at the end of the video. Let's see what we got. So the first thing that I got was this palette. Okay, so first of all, Primark eyeshadows are actually pretty good like I've got Primark eyeshadows I really really like them and this one is huge this is reminds me a lot of Morphe they had a whole nudes collection which is basically ripping off Kim Kardashian's KKW Beauty um, Primark honestly does a lot of bits that are copied off of a lot of different makeup brands that are up and coming or that are really, really popular right now. I don't blame them, to be honest. I'm really, really loving the dupes that they do. And you know me, if you've watched my channel for years, I absolutely love dupe videos. If you can find a cheaper alternative and save some buck, absolutely, let's do it. Now this has got seven, so 28. 28 eyeshadows for eight pounds. Now, eight pounds is obviously a lot of money, let's say, for Primark in that way, but for 28 eyeshadows, that's sick. So, yes, it's matte. It feels really, really nice. Um, packaging's nice as well, I like it. So this is the palette. There's a lot of neutrals, and we love a good neutral palette. Okay, this metallic shade, this brown, the darkest brown, and, oh, okay, you guys are gonna gag. Uh, and this soft brown, because I'm gonna use that a lot for transition color. Um, that's pretty true to colour to me. That's really good. The metallic shades are really nice. Hmm. So... The next thing that I got was one pound nails from Primark and these are just the silk touch nude colour. They've got a shine finish to them and honestly I get all my nails from Primark because after one use of using it then I just kind of chuck them away one pound you can't go wrong you know I've had acrylics done in the past but obviously like I jump from boy to dressed up whatever I don't always need to have nails on so I just buy the Primark ones I think they're great the nail glue is really good as well and they fit my nails really nicely they've got 24 in each pack so they've got 
so many different sizes in that way. Definitely, they've got um, they've got coffin shape, they've got square shaped, and they've got so many different colors. I go for the plain ones, but you can get crystal ones, you can get ombre ones, you can get the holographic ones. Primark are doing bits with the nails. Don't skimp on so it. So I've got three of the PS Matte lipsticks. Now, what does this remind you of, guys? This reminds me of the Mac Jean Batista collection from a few years back and I've wanted these for a while. I know they had a lot more shades. They've got satin shades which I didn't really like because I think the packaging looked really cheap on them. So I got the matte ones because they are a lot more similar to the MAC Jean Batista and they just look so nice. I got three nude shades. I got like um I got the shade in naked. I got the shade in thrill seeker and tickle. Wow. I mean, these names are, they, these names are fun, mm -hmm. I like the names. <laughs> I cannot open them up! So let's go ahead and swatch these. Ooh, yes! Look at that nude. Yes! They are so true to colour as well. Yes! These... These are the type of nudes that I like to wear anyway. This pink one, not so much, but these two, I'll definitely be rocking these a lot. For £1.50 for these matte lipsticks, I think they're great. Um, obviously, ooh, they smell nice. They smell, these smell like heaven. So basically at Primark, you don't just get makeup, you get some, they do hair bits, they do blow dryers, hair straighteners, uh, they do hair curlers, they also do, you know, travel stuff like travel toothbrushes, and there's so many th different things that you can get from there, like cuticle trimmers, and these are £1.50, a brush. A makeup brush. Now I've used Primark brushes in the past, they also do the unicorn brushes, the mermaid brushes, you know them that's been viral over the internet but for a cheaper price. They actually look really good. Um, now this is £3, this is the PS Pro tapered blush brush. I love a good tapered brush, like a lot of my brushes are tapered, you see? So I like this kind of shape. And um, this looks really soft because it's synthetic bristle, so obviously cruelty free, not tested on animals, anything like that. Let's have a look. Okay, so the handle's really nice. It's called 116 Tapered Blush Brush. They even named the brushes, like how good is that? Like a lot of brands don't do that. This is really nice. Okay, let's feel it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Synthetic bristles all the way. I actually really like synthetic brushes and I'd probably use this as like a bronzer, blusher, powder. You can use it for different things. Honestly, I don't use brushes for what they're intended to anyway. Not all the time, like I just use them for anything. Some people even use this for foundation because it's like a beauty blender shape. Yes. You know what, so far so good, I haven't had any duds whatsoever. So now for more lip products because I actually really like the lip products from Primark. I got myself the Pure PS lip gloss. Um, so they've got this whole Pure line which is basically Fenty Beauty. They copied Brianna's uh, makeup brand. This is called Fearless. Primark are fearless for copying everybody else's stuff, but I'm gonna lie, I rate it. I, I'm not complaining at all. So you get like a flat tip applicator and this is the gloss. It's kind of clearish and it goes with a lot of the nude colors. This would suit a lot of skin tones, actually. You know, lip scrubs are really big right now. This is the PS Berry Tastic. This was three pounds. And this is Strawberry Fragrance Lip Scrub. 16 grams of product. And um, it doesn't say if you can eat it, but a lot of lip scrubs you can eat because they taste really nice. You know what? It doesn't give me a warning. So, um, uh, it's a lip product. I might just put it on my tongue. Uh -huh. You know, well, you know, I always say to my friends that it's a bad day if you don't have, no, okay, that's really bad. No, I can't say that on camera. Okay, me and Laura, uh, my mate from uni, shout out to Laura. We kind of just hang out and just eat lip scrubs. Um, 
This doesn't have a warning if I shouldn't eat it. So I'm gonna put it in my mouth. Oh yeah, tastes good. Oh yeah, oh yeah, we're on to... <laughs> um, mm, mm, mm. We're on to a winner. Mm. This probably isn't really healthy at all. Mmm. That tastes sick. So Laura, when you come visit my flat, we're gonna be eating some lip scrub. <laughs> oh my gosh, that tastes good. Okay, we're on to the last two things. <laughs> Guys, don't skimp on the reduction aisle because Primark still does bits in the reduction sale section. This is the face wrapping mask, the Hyaluronic Solution 80. This is a Korean brand. So honestly, I love Korean face masks so much. And this was four pounds, now it's two pounds. And um, I love anything that's got hyaluronic acid in it. Hyaluronic acid, rejuvenates the skin and has a lot of water content so it moisturizes it hydrates the skin i love sheet masks so much and i actually leave these on overnight even though they say that you're only supposed to have them on for 10 to 20 minutes but i like to have the juices just drank into my skin you know what i mean like I just love that, you know, just chill the whole night and keep it on overnight, you know, let your skin drink up all the juices. I put it on my face and put the rest of the juices on my neck. And I definitely, definitely will be buying more from Primark just because they've got a huge range. The last final thing was the PS Glow setting spray. Yo, this bottle is pretty big. Like a lot of setting sprays. Look at my, look at my Catrice one. Okay, this one has 50 mil and this has 110 mil for four pounds. Yo, I'm gonna put this on. Like, they've got a few different ones. I think they've got just a normal one. They've got the Primark, um, Primal Water. They've got the matte one as well. And even this, yeah, the packaging is pretty lit. Like, this looks high end. This one's the glow one because I like to glow. I don't like to be overly ma- Ooh. Is it one of the aerosol ones? Yes. Okay. Let's see. No, it's not. No, it's not. It's just a spray. <laughs> oh, it smells nice. Mmm. I like my face to get nice and wet and then let it dry. Ooh, it's got illuminating pearls, aloe vera, and vitamin B5. Good to know. <laughs> so, dun, 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 dun. If you have been keeping up with all the price that I've been telling you, what has this haul accumulated to? We have reached a grand total of 30 pounds. We have mastered the challenge. We have got... 30 pounds worth of beauty products. Yo, Primark, claps to you. I really rate you. If you guys want me to do a fashion edition of this challenge and create a whole outfit out of Primark clothing, then let me know down below. We can do different things. You can you can go to River Island. Oh, 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 I don't really rate a River Island. We could do Top Man, we could do Top Shop, we can do Zara, I really rate Zara. And I think it's just really, really interesting, especially for people who are in the UK, to know what to buy in their stores or also anyone who's wanting to visit the UK from abroad. So um, I really like this type of video. Oh yeah. Oh, the setting spray has dried. And yeah, I see I see the glow. I do, do you see this forehead glow? It is glowing, mm-hmm. Yes, okay. <laughs> and on that note, I am going to love you and leave you. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Love doing different videos like this. I want to do more for sure. And subscribe to my channel. Bye guys.